Coach, when you guys start the off season, what was your message to this football team? Well, I just think, you know, that they had to come to work every single day and have a great attitude and, and, and work their tails off. And that, that's something that we've kind of been talking ever since we got there back in January. And, uh, you know, we put that up in every meeting room, everywhere in the building, attitude and effort. So if you have that great attitude every single day, work your tails off, then good things are going to happen. The offseason, man, has been tough. Um, you know, just ridiculous running. Just to see who's going to buy into the program and see who's mentally tough. we got to get all the weak links out, and that's what he did. Coach Mike, our strength coach, he weeded, you know, a lot of the weak links out, man, and a lot of guys, you know, you know, they got weeded out, like I said, man. And so, I mean, we're a tough core right now, and, um, you know, you have to be tough mentally and physically to play this game. It's definitely been a grind. Definitely, if I could explain it in one word, definitely a grind, but it's been a grind that we're all, we're starting to embrace. When you looked at this team from last season, when you went back over the tapes, what did you see positive that you can bring into this year? Well, I, I didn't look at the tape from last year. <laughs> I mean, I, I, and when we first had our meeting, like, listen guys, we're cleaning the slate, we're moving forward, everything that we're doing. Um, you know, what I can say positive though, is the guys have worked their tails off. Uh, as we go through spring practice in, in, in February, all the way through to, to right now, they've put a lot of time and effort and energy in it. Um, they're, they're really coming together as a team. The chemistry is so huge. Um, playing for your brothers beside you is huge. All the things, we, they're holding each other accountable. You know, all those things, we've come a long way. And uh, that's exciting as the coaches see it, and, and our players are excited about it as well. One of the most important things, the early success is gonna be the play of your quarterback. You got Malik Cunningham from a pass. How's that quarterback core looked as a whole? Uh, they've looked good. I think they've, they're really coming along well, but it's going to come down to decision making uh, at the quarterback position. You know, when you're doing, you know, zone reads, the RPOs, all the things that happen so fast, how quickly can they decipher that and make that proper decision? And I think that's what it's going to come down to. It, those guys are talented. They're very good players. Um, they can play at a high level. Um, and I'm, I'm excited about all our quarterbacks. And so um, as we get through this process in August, we'll. The guy we trot out there will be the one that makes the best decisions. Both of them are great athletes. I mean, Malik, is, he's, he's the one of the most athletic people on the team. So, I mean, they, they're both they're great football players. Now they just have to translate to being, like, great quarterbacks. You know, of course, they're learning a new system. But, I mean, they're, they're coming along. They've been working hard. They've easily been one of the hardest working groups on the team. Who are some other players on offense that have stood out thus far? Well, I think, you know, several guys. I think, you know, one in particular, Hassan Hall is a running back that I think has, has had a really good offseason. He's worked hard. He had a good, really good spring. Um, you know, he, he's going to be a guy that's going to get a lot of touches in, in the defensive, uh, I mean, in the running back room. Um, you know, and then I think out, out wide, you know, I think the receivers, to me, is one of our strengths of our team overall. Um, of course, Seth, and then, you know, you got Fitzpatrick, you got um, Tutu, you know, you got some playmakers in the wide receiver room that I think we obviously got to get them the ball and, and let that magic happen out there. Defensively, where did this staff begin as far as rebuilding this defense and be able to take them to the next level? Yeah, we, right back to the basics. I think, um, you know, we're, we're coming in with an, an odd front defense, a little bit of a change up of what we're doing philosophy wise, um, and really right from the start, just teaching those guys um, what we're looking for. And it's all about fit. You know, in this defense, everybody has to fit. You have a gap, you got to get to your gap. And it, and it goes all the way from the front, all the way to the back. They're grasping that understanding. Um, they're, they're really doing a good job with that. Um, and then running to the football. You know, I think for us, we talk about staying on top, chasing the ball. Um, you know, and fitting the numbers. And, and that's kind of where we're at. Um, you know, so we're excited about the defense. I know, uh, you know, there's a lot of room for improvement there. And I feel like um, that we could end up having a really good defense this year. We have to stay consistent. It doesn't matter if we just, we have a good um, first half, we have to finish the game out. That was a lot of times during the season last year where we would start off pretty decent and then second half get like 30, 40 points put up. So, I mean, it, it doesn't matter what you do if you don't finish. What should we expect from this Louisville team in year one under your team? Well, the thing that we're going to look for is a consistent effort every single day. So, you know, when, when the fan or anybody that's watching our team, they're going to know start, them guys play hard. And that's what we want. If we'll go out there every day and play as hard as we can play, good things are going to happen. We're never going to talk about, you know, wins or this or that. All we're talking about is that attitude and that great effort every single day. And when we do that, I think we'll put a product on the field that, that coordination will be proud of.